The sky hangs still, a blanket of blue, empty and vast. Then a shape appears on the horizon. It is not a giant. It is not a thunderous beast of war that announces its arrival with a roar that shakes the very ground. This one is different. It is small. It is sleek. It is impossibly fast. The pilot, with a practiced and gentle hand, tilts the nose upward. The plane climbs, slicing through the air with quiet confidence. Less machine, more living thing. A predator at home in its element. On the ground, the world watches. This is the Gripen, a name that whispers of ancient myth, of a creature both powerful and wise. Born not in a superpower sprawl, but in Sweden's thoughtful workshops. In one graceful moment, it stunned a world that thought it knew air power. The Saab Gripen is, at its heart, a fighter jet. But call it only that, and you miss the point entirely. Conceived and built in Sweden, pragmatism and ingenuity. Exceptionally light, deliberately so, to move like few can. Agility that leaves heavier opponents struggling to keep pace. Remarkably clever, advanced tech woven into its core. More than twice the speed of sound, intercept or escape in a blink. A true multi-role platform, fighter, scout, even forward air controller. Forged in the north to thrive in ice, snow, and long dark nights. Most jets are runway queens, needing pristine concrete and massive bases. The Gripen can launch from a simple stretch of public road. Land on short, hastily prepared airstrips. By design, not gimmick. A core Swedish doctrine. Survive the first strike, keep fighting. While others sit as targets, the Gripen disperses, flies, fights, defends. Less infrastructure, more independence. A quiet revolution. It matters more than most imagine. The story of the Gripen is the story of Sweden. Neutrality, self-reliance, nestled between great powers. A philosophy forged for defending home, not projecting power. Fewer numbers meant more cleverness and efficiency. Gripen, the ultimate expression of that mindset. Survival built into every rivet and circuit. Maintenance. Time is the most precious resource. Designed for small crews with basic training. Modular systems. Parts replaced rapidly. An engine in under an hour. Refuel, rearm, and relaunch in minutes. A combat turn. Do it from a reinforced rural highway. Operate far from nerve centers elusive, resilient. Strength isn't only power, it's endurance. A promise, resilient, resourceful, determined, like Sweden. Beneath its skin lies formidable intelligence. Power and agility are only part of modern combat. The real battle lives in data, sensors, communication. Here, the Gripen excels. Sophisticated computers and state-of-the-art radar, seeing far, seeing clearly, friend or foe, discriminated with precision. Genius not just in what it sees, but in what it shares. A team of hunters, eyes shared, moves synchronized. One of the first designed for network-centric warfare. It talks to ground stations, naval vessels, and troops. From lone wolf to nerve center, a multi-tool with a diverse arsenal, long and short-range missiles, precision bombs, rockets, quickly reconfigured for any mission. A single squadron can cover roles that need multiple types elsewhere. Defend airspace one moment, support troops the next. It fights with speed and power, and with information. The word cost is heavy in military aviation. It grounds fleets, shrinks air forces, creates vulnerability. Top fighters cost staggering sums to buy, fly, and maintain. Tens of thousands per flight hour. Fuel, parts, manpower. For many nations, it's impossible. Gripen rewrites the rules, a sustainable path to air superiority. Not cheap, affordable over its entire life. Lower purchase price than main competitors, numbers matter. 20 capable jets, 10 super jets, half grounded. Among the lowest operational costs, efficient single engine, reliable, easy maintenance. 
More training, more hours, sharper pilots. An ace in a good jet beats an average pilot in a superior one. Affordability translates to combat effectiveness. A shock to planners trapped in rising cost cycles. Credible air power within reach. The Gripen democratized the sky. For years it proved its worth, respected for efficiency and agility. Then came the shock. Not a single blast, but waves of revelation. Whispers from exercises, leaked test data, airshow proof. The quiet Swede had a secret move, a capability so advanced it demanded a reassessment. Clarity arrived during complex war games, unprecedented networked capability, seamless integration with drones, a pilot directing a drone's sensors, remote eyes ahead, see what the drone sees, an extension of the aircraft, acquire with the drone, launch from the Gripen, all while remaining miles away, radar silent, a launch and leave revolution, the Gripen, a network quarterback in the sky. More than a party trick, a statement about conflict. The era of one-on-one -on -one metrics is fading. Now, complex webs of information. It's about data, speed of decision, who sees, understands, acts fastest. Gripen is built for this fight. Drones, satellites, ground forces, networking is central. Small drone fixes a target. The Gripen stays electronically silent a lethal, accurate strike from beyond defenses. It flips the calculus, higher success, lower risk. It's not the size of the dog, it's the size of the network. A smart node with fused inputs for the pilot. The pilot is now a battlefield manager. Calm, data-driven control replaces chaotic dogfights. A shockwave, smarter, connected beats bigger, costlier. The future is collaboration and sharing. War is a contest of networks. Gripen is a master player. Public silence. Private scrambles. Hesitant to credit a smaller nation's aircraft. Inside, intense analysis. Test data reviewed. Models updated. Core assumptions questioned. Are we on the right path? Have we chased bigger, more complex, more expensive? at the expense of agility, affordability, and networks? Investing in aerial dinosaurs, magnificent, powerful, ill-suited, technological superiority, not assured. For smaller nations, it was hope and opportunity. Air shows busier, calls to sob surged, a thorn to the established, a beacon to the rest, a symbol of neutrality and fierce independence. It didn't need to win every sim, it needed to exist and perform, and it changed the global conversation. In the end, what is the Gripen's legacy? Not a statistic, nor a boast. It is the quiet shift it inspired, a symbol in the sky, brilliant craftsmanship and foresight. Strength isn't size, loudness isn't intelligence. It proved to a watching world. New warfare demands new tools and thinking, the moment the world noticed was historic. A pivot from old certainties to a networked future. The power of clear, purposeful design. Small teams, tight budgets, out-innovating giants. No rooftop shouting, just performance. Worth proven by action. Surprise was real because capability was real. And the world took note. We remember the elegant climb. Screens lighting with shared data. A web spun in an instant, a calm, steady hand, master of a complex machine. Silence, then whispers, then headlines, then new plans. In its quiet way, the Gripen shocked the world. The next leap may come not with a boom, but with data. It flew. It showed power and grace. It showed a new way forward.